Hello, I'm Edwina Sands. People often ask me, was your grandfather Winston Churchill a good painter? I always answer emphatically, yes, he was a good painter because he painted what he loved. He loved his garden at Chartwell. He loved the black swans on the lake. In particular, he loved the goldfish pond. I remember him throwing flakes into the water, delighting at the golden flashes that leapt to the surface as if from nowhere. He was the only artist I ever met. I remember as a child standing behind him watching as he put magic on the canvas. This is Finer Stars, a painting I've made of my grandfather at the easel. Grandpapa is in black and white, surrounded by colored books. All the books are either by him or about him. In the foreground are some of his favorite things. The painting within the painting on the easel is one of my favorites. Let me show you a little closer. He loved painting outdoors. He loved painting landscapes, seascapes, skyscapes, scapes of all sorts. This painting he called Bottlescape. I think it must have been raining that day. Otherwise he would have been painting outside in the garden. The canvas still hangs at Chartwell and it sums up for me his love of life See the fine array of decanters and bottles, some opened. See the disarray of half-filled glasses. It is quite loosely painted, but you know exactly what each bottle holds and what it tastes like. Bottlescape evokes with Proustian certainty the familiar scent of the cedar wood cigar boxes stacked up on the side. Rich reds and browns bold white highlights on all the shiny objects, the table lamp with the orange shade, all cast a warm glow over the whole scene. Was Winston Churchill a good painter? Though I'm biased as a judge, I did hear once that Pablo Picasso said of him, that man could have made a good living as an artist if he had not had so many other things to do.